Yeah, so here's a quick pack bait recipe that I make for catching raccoons. You can use it for catching catfish, carp. Pretty simple, pretty quick. We we'll put a thing of jello into a bowl. Go ahead. Good. Oh my gosh. Yep. Okay. Now we will put now a thing of panko. Uh, yep, pour it in there. All of it. Just pour it in. Yeah, all of it. Why all of it? Just pour it in there. Okay. <laughs> and then we'll put one can of corn. Put it in there. It sounds like pink. Yep, now we'll get a spoon to mix it up. Okay, now mix it up, get it, get in there. It looks like it's really up. Mix it up real good. No, Dad. Yeah, let Jackson have a try. That smells good. Mix it up. Ew. It smells good. Okay, we'll keep mixing this and we'll show you the finished product. Okay, so we added a little bit of water. It was a little bit too dry. But this is about the consistency you want. You want it to be able to pack like this. Just like that. Okay. So now we'll take it out and bait some traps. So the traps we're going to be using are just some Duke dog proofs. Uh, nothing fancy, but they work great for uh, raccoons. So uh, this one's got packed full of mud but uh basically you'll just set your trap stake it in the ground and then put your bait in it and then hopefully the next day a coon comes and gets in there so that's what we'll do <laughs> the cheese cheese smile at me there we go and this raccoon can get, get some corny. Yeah. I got bucket in full of it. So let's get bowled out and the raccoons will get it. It's here. Or here. And someone can get over here. And when we run out, we can get some more. That's my boy. I'm throwing coins at the raccoons. <laughs> okay, now film this. Okay, now this is how you set a dog proof. Basically, all you do is you got this, which is your trigger, and that's inside there. They'll, they'll hit that. So all you gotta do is pull it, push this down, move this to where it's right in line with that. Now that trap's set. And then all you gotta do is take your stake, stake it into the ground, push this into the ground, and then put your bait in. I'm hammering these in. Then we'll sit here and hammer these stakes down. Hey, can I do one? And then we'll go through. Can I do one, Dad? And hammer all these stakes down. Can I do that next one? Yep, Jackson, you hammer this one in. Okay. Let me see it. And he'll hammer that one in. There you go, buddy. Keep going. Okay, we'll get it. I can do it. Okay, Nora, give it a shot. Let Nora, no, don't hit it with that side. Let Nora try. Okay, Nora, go over there and hammer it in. Keep going until it's flush with the ground. Nice. Look at me. Look at me, Jackson. Okay, and we'll just go through and do the rest of those. And we'll get back. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the bait. He's got it in his hand. 
And what I like to do, and it's worked for me in the past, is come here, Jackson. Sprinkle some around the trap. So just sprinkle some around the trap. Just drop it on the ground. Yep, just sprinkle that whole handful around the trap. Just crush it up around the trap. Yep, just like that. Good job. So go get a little bit more. And then make about a marble size. So here, let me see it. Then what I like to do is I get a piece, just a few pieces. And then I'll just drop it down in there like that. Make sure it gets down into the trap. So this is what we got. We sprinkled some of it around. And then we put some down in there. Making sure that it gets down to the bottom so that way they got to dig in there and get it so uh we'll go through and we'll bait the rest of the traps and then uh hopefully we catch some coons tonight they've been hitting this little diy corn feeder i made for the deer out here uh, so we'll see how it goes my boat's not wet okay guys and here's the finished product we got the traps baited up put out a little bit more corn trying to get these deer to use this feeder here uh, hopefully it'll start using it that way I can feed them throughout the rest of the winter and through the summers supplement some food to them I'm gonna use that log for a mineral block but uh we'll see I've been having a lot of raccoons hitting this every single every night almost seven raccoons so uh, we got six dog proofs out I've pulled six before in one night, so we'll see what happens. Uh, we got a camera set up, Tacticam, so it'll catch and let us know what happens. Okay, buddy, what are we doing? Oh, we're going to see if we caught some raccoons. Okay, let's go. We set the traps over here, so we're going to walk up <clears throat> and see if we got it. <laughs> what do you think, buddy? You think we caught any? Yeah. It's been snowing at night, getting pretty yeah. cold. Um, it's been pretty cold, so our food is gonna get some more weight. Yeah. I noticed that the raccoons haven't been coming around as much with how cold and snowy it's been getting. So let's, let's see if we actually food. caught one. So. Let's see. <clears throat> okay, we're getting closer. There's the feeder. We see. I see a raccoon. What? We got one. Yeah. Let's take a look at it. Yeah. Don't get too close. Stay back a little bit. Let's look at him. Yep. There he is. He was a little bandit. Well, we'll get him dispatched and we'll reset the trap and maybe we'll catch some more. Hi, little buddy. Okie doke, guys.